Thanks for joining us as we welcome you today for Saturday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson here live. Welcome to the MCG. Cloudy skies overhead for this match. Providing special comments for today's game is Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Really excited about this one today. For today's match, we have Carlton and the Eagles. They run on in full confidence there, looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. The captains prepare for the toss of the coin. West Coast winning the toss. Round 19. Both these teams coming off good wins last week. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. What an exciting matchup we have here today. The umpire gets things underway. Cruiser got in the better position. Kelly shrugs off the tackle. Clears the ball from the contest. Couldn't complete the mark. Vardy goes for goal. That kick was pure. Of course, Hunter. He loved that one. The first goal going to West Coast. This is how they can score big, Hunter. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. That's a really good team goal. Back in the middle. Cruiser won it down. Cripps puts the handball out in front. Rioli gets the ball. Has it now. Kerno spinning through brilliantly. Getting pushed out of the way was Kennedy. Ryan drives the kick. Goes for the goal. Off the ground. He's kicked the goal. He acknowledges the crowd. West Coast could kick the last two goals. The margin is 12. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Handballs to a teammate on the run. And now O'Brien, hurried kick. March back over the top. Goes by foot. Yo was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. He drives it. They can create from this. Kennedy fends off the tackle. Marks now, and can send it back. With a driving kick. A chance to gather the ball. Archie had the pressure bearing down. Ryan has missed. The Eagles with a handy break. They lead Carlton 13 to 0. O'Brien found a way to mark that one. Uses it now. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Drives it long. They chase after the loose ball. Go for goal number one. And the chance at goal is taken by West Coast. Gaff extends the lead from that kick. Pretty happy with that one. That's three in a row for West Coast. 
Now they lead by 19. Thrashes it with the ball now. No, goes through the tackle. Puts it on the boot. Finds a target. West Coast are allowing the opposition uncontested marks, but they sit up behind the ball so well it forces the opposition to play that style. Slick with the hands. He's got the football now. Doherty just streaming past and gets the footy. Murphy with an easy mark. Spent it before he earned it. Scoops up the ball. Collected by Nunes. Doing well to intercept that kick. Puts boot to ball. Redden wants to keep it moving by hand. Off hands from Hutchings. Gaff uses the bump. Yo will be the recipient of the free. He gives it a ride. That's a big goal. What an effort. Yo, getting the crowd involved. That's four in a row for the Eagles. 25 points the difference. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Umpire ready to resume play. Guided down nicely by Cruiser. Darling puts it to his advantage. Takes possession. Intervening brilliantly was Murphy. Gaff wins the foot race. Sweeping handball. Hutching marks uncontested. Moves the ball along the wing. Archie found some space and marked. The kick will be from a 45 degree angle. Going for goal number one. Doing well to intercept that kick. Plowman kicks it. McCready gets in a good position. Sinks the slipper into it. Takes a simple grab. Uses it now. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Ball gets cut off. Hands that ball to the opposition. Good mark there. Moved on by Doherty. The mark has been taken. Walsh has resources out wide. He takes the mark. Moves the ball by foot. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Walsh couldn't dispose of it properly. Fantastic tackle. Takes the shot into the post of goals. The lead is now 26. West Coast have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should try and slow it down and control the ball for a moment. Goes with the kick. Jetek releases by hand. Shuey gets on the end of that handball. Ryan thumps it towards goal. Sockers it through for a goal. Smiles all round. West Coast could kick the last five goals. The margin is 32. Cruiser does well. The ball spills the gap. Showing some really good pressure there. Shepard slams it onto the boot. He gets his hands on the footy. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Plowman sends it into space. He can take off after that handball. Wiedering finds possession. Spent that one before he earned it. Gets the handball away. Hearn has a teammate on the move. The mark has been taken. West Coast are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. A chance to reload the attack now. Looks to move it by foot. A solid Carlton with some work to do as they go into quarter time, trailing by 32. The Eagles started well, now it's time for them to do it for four quarters.
time to take a look at the stats. West Coast have taken control of the outside game. They've been able to find more. Players ready to start the second quarter. Back with another set of bounce. Hammers it. He wins possession. Murphy rushes with the kick. Takes the mark. Goes by foot. Kelly finding it in motion. Darling takes it well. Got boot to ball. Great grab. Gaff plays it on. A strong pack mark. Kick by Archie. Kennedy takes the mark. 40 metres from home. Going for goal number one. He's missed. West Coast with the ascendancy over Carlton, leading 33 to zero. Weighing up the options now. Rushes with the kick. Wins the race to the ball. Teammates break for him. Fisher leading the race to the loose ball. Ball up calls. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Fans off the tackler. Simpson with quick hands. Trying to avoid everything out there. He lays off the pass. He drives it towards goal. <laughs> 35 points the difference. Plowman to kick it in. Marking in space with O'Brien. Slams it on the boot. Hutchings leaps over the top. Probing kick inside the 50. Does well to cut off the kick. Doherty moves it now. It's a foot race to get this one. Found a way to keep it alive. Gaff continues to find the ball. He's been superb tonight, mate. Ryan will kick from beyond the 50. Look it on. He heads for home. What a kick. And he puts it through. This kick stretches the lead. His teammates rush over. The margin is 41. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. The Blues can't get their hands to the footy if they can win more of the ball than they can get back into this one. A great defensive effort. Duggan cuts it off. Fights the good fight. Shoe goes with the kick. Marks now and can send it back. Keeps the kick low. Well picked up. Kerno will be the recipient of the free. He drives it. High tackle. Martin gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Going for goal number one. He's excited about that one. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? Carlton badly needed that one. Martin getting the crowd involved. Centre bounce. Punched away. The ball in the hands of Duggan. Nice mark under pressure. The Eagles have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. McCready throws the ball away. They can create from this. Going for goal number one. Unbelievable. And they put it through. Kennedy enjoying that goal. West Coast Clee is now 41. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. He did really well there and gets the reward. We're back in the middle to resume play. Thump clear quickly onto the boot. Kurnow spills it, uses a short handball. 
A clean pick-up. Ball gets cut off. Easily takes the mark. 25 metres out. A must-kick goal here. He's excited about that one. Carlton produced the margin. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. West Coast have taken charge of the contested ball. It's allowing them to create their scoring opportunities. Has a runner alongside him. Hands that ball to the opposition. Wiedering with the ball. Jetta doesn't take the mark. Hacking it out of there. McGovern lobs the handball. At full stride, receives the handball. Barracks gains possession. Jockety runs onto the field. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. Uses the hands instead of the body, and it's a free kick. Kasbolt looks in a bit of pain. That doesn't look good. I don't think he'll be coming back. McKay pulls the trigger. That one will really work. Yes, uh, that's his first. Get some reward for his efforts. Carlton close the gap to 29. He did really well there, and gets the reward. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Carlton, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Murphy was taken high in the tackle. Sinks the slipper into it. Takes it well. West Coast haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Going for goal number one. Kept his head and kept the goal. No doubt about it. back in this game the game is back underway swats it he gains possession march bank made a meal of that one mccready kicks in heavy traffic jetta takes a strong mark did well to get a hand in with a driving kick moves it by foot news releases the ball a strong mark in the pack from Hearn. West Coast are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Ryan to have the shot from outside 50. Lining up from a 45-degree angle. Lining up for goal number four. A great goal. This one gives them a bigger lead. They get around him after that effort. West Coast doing well at the moment. Hickey with the hit. He's got the footy in his hands. Shuey gurns a freak. West Coast with the upper hand at half time, leading by 29. West Coast have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. Ryan, the number one ranked player on the ground. He's the most dominant player on the ground at the moment. We're halfway through this match and things are getting interesting.
The third quarter about to get underway. We resume hostilities. Cruiser thumps it clear. Gets a quick kick away. He gets above the crowd. Barracks keeping it low. A chance to gather the ball. Goes short by hand. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He's barely touched the ball lately. Shepard hasn't seen much of the footy. Plowman didn't mark it. News has resources out wide. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. West Coast forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Weedery choosing to play on. Intercepts the ball well. Dug out the loose ball. Kerno missed an opportunity to mark. Murphy takes aim. That's something to smile about. Gets his first. Celebrating hard. The Blues now only trail by 23. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Thumps it clear. Cruiser on the ball. Releases by hand. Going for goal number one. Casbah controlling the airwaves on this occasion. They can't afford to be wasting these shots at goal from the corridor. Looking to kick goal number two. Casbolt loves that goal. Carlton close the gap to 17. We're back in the middle now. Vardy with a big fist on it. This is Gav. Nunes gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Coughed up by Nelson. Movement by hand. Kicks hurriedly. Wins the race to the ball. Kerno won himself a free. Puts it on the boot. Nice hands. Cripps lines up from long range. Casbolt has it. This is the easiest shot for goal you'll ever have. Carlton have three in a row. Carlton behind by 11. The ball bubbling around. He has the ball. He gains possession. McGovern takes the mark and contested. Elects to kick. He gives chase to the footy. He decides to go for home. Simply outplayed his opponent. Drives the kick hard. Finds a target. Chose to kick it. Strong mark in the contest. Uses it by foot. That's an easy decision for the umpire. Good opportunity for Carlton to put a goal through here. 20 metres out. Betts needs a big effort to put this through from here. He slams it towards goal. Hearn tucks it into the pocket. Turned it over. Kennedy decides to go it alone. He slots this one. A big goal there. He puts through his first goal. He's excited about that one. Carlton reduced the margin. About to resume play. Thump clear. Gets the loose ball. Going for goal number one. Ends up turning this ball over. Looks up with the kick. An easy grab for Hearn. Hearn tucks it into the pocket. Marks all alone. Gets a hand to the ball. The umpire calls for a stoppage. It's a big stage of this game. Shepard just gets a boot to it. Cruiser. Fair to mop up. He gives it a ride. That ball. Carlton now only trail by four, considering the options on the kick in. And the mark will be paid. They'll snatch the lead if this goes through. That is a stunning goal. That will settle the nerves. 
gets his first on the board. A time to celebrate, and don't they get around Kuno? That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. West Coast are struggling in front of goal today and it's costing them. Bad kicking is bad football. He's got the football now. Manufactures the handball. Kerno with the opportunity. Makes the most of that kick. It's a goal. A second goal in the bag. He celebrates hard after that. Carlton by eight points. We're back in motion. Swatson, he gets his hands on the footy. Barris couldn't snaffle it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. That's right, Hano. He just can't seem to get into the game. Just gave it away. The kick comes close. That is offline. The lead is now nine. Players move as they look to provide an option. Puts boot to ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hano. He's gone missing lately. The kick connects with the post. Carlton for 10. Carlton have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. He's having a big game right now. He's really having a big impact on this game. He makes that kick count. Full price. Nunes getting his first with that kick. Look at them celebrate that effort. Carlton he is now 16. Clears the contest. Opportunity for Kelly. Doing well to intercept that kick. Carlton have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Not much time left in the quarter. Drives it out of the pack. Gathers it now. Clears the congestion. Three-quarter time. Carlton 69 plays West Coast 53. A quarter of footy to go. Carlton walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. A high-scoring third term sees opportunity for both sides heading into the final quarter. Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. West Coast are doing well to control the ball in the air. They are getting to the right spots to cut off opposition attacks. They just need to be more controlled from this point forward. Cheers, Gaz. Last quarter action, ready to go. Oh, they've got to take some risks now. They can't afford to waste any time. Thump by Fardy. Collects the loose ball. Links with hands. Cruiser just throws. Tries to gain some territory. Snaffled up by O'Brien. Doherty has had plenty of it, Gaz. He has been outstanding here, Hunter. Cruiser throws the ball away. Decides to kick. They chase after the loose ball. Doherty can link up through hands. O'Brien gets a quick kick away. Manages to get a hand to it. Archie just put it on the boot. Gaff takes it strongly. Gets a touch to the ball. Kelly might kick a goal. That one hits the woodwork. West Coast has dropped more than two goals behind. Plowman to bring it back into play. He looks like he needs a spell. Plowman kicks hard along the boundary line. A good job keeping it in play there. Unfortunately, not for long as the ball goes out. Umpire calls for a throw-in. 
What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Kept alive under pressure. Rioli shows some physicality. He runs it over the line. Vardy making his way onto the field. Umpire calls for a boundary throw. Ball tossed back in. Mops up the loose ball. Vardy gets onto the ball. Kennedy just too high with the tackle. Kick by Duggan. Gaff needs to lift. He needs to find a way into this game. He's really turning it on now. His teammates rush over. It's under two goals now. Hickey hurls it away. Kennedy won himself a free. Kicks to the square. Open opportunity for Simpson. Goes with the kick. Gets into a good position to take them. The kick from McCready. Good body work to win the mark. Chose to kick it. Doing well with the mark. Cripps puts it on the boot. Ball up in the centre square. Punches it clear. A clean collect. Mugabe picks up the loose ball. Got boot to ball. Needs a bit of a rest. Rioli off the deck. Finds a way to go along the ground. He just loved that one. Scoreboard isn't too much of a worry given how long we have left. Thrashes it, putting his skills on display. Duggan is streaming past and gets the footy. Works hard to get on the end of that. Cripps spears the ball. Marked by Yo. Yo just threw it. McCready sends one up towards the wing. A chance to reload the attack now. Cripps elects to kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. Heads for the boundary line. It's a foot race to get this one. Darling gets the handball away. They can link up now. Walsh keeps coming. Fighting hard was Kerno. Ends up turning this ball over. Almost cut it off. The ball mopped up. Just gets it onto the boot. Redden finds the ball on the move. Goes by foot. Murphy hangs onto that one. Puts it on the boot. Needs a bit of a rest. Hurried kick. Cripps couldn't snaffle it. Simpson couldn't complete the tackle. Has to do better in that mark contest. Puts boot to ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, have A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. Stabs at the kick. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Kelly a long way out. Going for goal number one. The drop part sails between the big sticks. Smiles all round. They're in front. Back in the middle now. Punched away. He wins possession. The handball now from Hutchings. Kennedy looking to put through another goal. Takes that one strongly. Lining up on a bit of an angle here is Ryan. They're doing really well to choose some time off the clock here. Four goals to his name so far. Looking for a fifth. He acknowledges the crowd. West Coast 78, Clay Carlton 69. Hickey gets onto the ball. Hutchings clears the ball from the contest. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Shuey will be the recipient of the free. to kick it long. Steady hands there as he holds that one. 40 metres from home. Moving on. Going for goal number one. Hits the post and it's a minor. The Eagles doing well at the moment. Plowman weighing up the options now. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Good mark there. O'Brien marks. 
He drives it. Duggan determined to reach the ball. Kennedy was taken high in the tackle. Uses it now. Rioli runs after this one. Jetta just dismisses McGovern. Takes a simple grab. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Carlton fans certainly will be disappointed about that result. I thought we saw one side capitalise on their chances and the other didn't. And so often we see that determine the result. Final scores are 79 to 69. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. It was great to be here, Hutto. I'll be back next time. We stick together.